Today I'm talking about habits. And a lot of you already know about habits. You may have some bad habits that you want to get rid of, correct? Am I right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm right. Here's the thing about habits. If you want to get rid of a bad habit, you got to be self-aware enough to notice that you have one and what leads you to doing something. Usually a habit is established in place. It could be from a trigger that is set in to allow you to do the habits that you do. Once you recognize that you have a trigger that leads you to take a certain action and it's built in over a certain period of time, and this is like any type of behavior. So once that habit is set in, it's really hard to get rid of. I mean, it's super hard to get rid of. And this is especially true if the habit was set in in some situation that maybe you were stressed, so it allowed you to get into this habit. Maybe it became an addiction where you started overeating, or simply it just became a repetition thing that deeply ingrained into your brain. And again, like I said, habits are really hard to get rid of. And to set in place a good habit, it's even harder to do. And here's the reason why so many people fell in terms of trying to set a new habit. They're doing it wrong. Number one, they're looking for a quick habit change. And that's not going to happen. It doesn't happen that way. Number two, they're trying to willpower their way into creating a new habit. And that is super hard to do. And number three, they're setting in the habit the wrong way. And let me address those points. In order for a habit to be set in place, it should be done in spaced repetition. This is the way we would learn just about anything, including setting a new habit. Should be done over a period of time and should be set by the, in fact, the, the Kaizen way. 1% improvement, the small little steps that you take getting to creating that habit. And as we know, it takes an average of 66 days to create a new habit. Some people's gonna take longer, some people's gonna take shorter. But on average, with the latest research, it's about 66 days. I would shoot for as long as it takes to set it in. And again, don't use willpower. There is a much better way. Much better way. It's called having fun. Yeah. Because when you have fun doing something, and let's take exercise for example. The reason it's hard for most people to get up and exercise, because they look at it as work. They look at it as effort. And when you look at something as work and effort, it's not fun. It's not fun at all. And guess what's going to happen? Most people are going to drop off because it's not fun. My suggestion with any habit, find a way of making it fun. So let's go back to exercise. How could you make exercise or something that relates to exercise that incorporates physical movement? These suggestions I've made in the past with some of my clients is to maybe get into dancing. And dancing has proven to be super beneficial. It's beneficial for your physical body. And because it's fun, you're going to want to do more of it. And number two, because of the way the physical movement is done in dancing, it's great for your brain. And this actually is one of the latest studies that came out in neuroscience. So dancing is great for your brain. So I just get out there and just get out and move your body, move and groove. Finally, just know where those habits start and take place. So if you find a bad habit that's related to a certain trigger that leads you to, do, to take a certain action, be aware of it and look at immediately setting in that new habit, that more positive habit that's going to get you moving towards your goals much faster. And again, make it fun because when you do that, you're, you're going to want to do more of it. And that's the reason people eat like junk food because junk foods gives immediate gratification immediate joy so you can do the same thing with a positive habit find something immediate that gratification notice that trigger 
replace it with that new positive feel good habit so this is bob telling you to start setting in habits in a much better more fun over the long term way 